So welcome to another Machine Monday. Today I want to take you through a very simple solution we've come up with to try and avoid this paper-based production recording. So basically what you see on many production lines, either, either on a whiteboard or a big piece of paper like this, is a planned schedule. So in other words, how many parts need to be produced per hour and the cumulative total. And what happens is every morning the shift supervisor has to come uh, to the board and actually fill in all of this information, what variant, um, etc., needs to be set up uh, and built in the next eight hour shift. And it's a very manual process that happens. And obviously as they build components by hour, they would uh, sort of write um, how many they produce. So let's say in the first hour they made 20, which is according to target. Uh, but the next hour they only made 10, so the cumulative total is actually uh, uh, 30. Um, and if, let's say there were 10 NOK parts uh, uh, from, uh, from that particular hour. And basically what happens is as the day goes on, the supervisor is busy filling uh, this piece of information in. And um, they also have to put any reasons for sort of failures so over here. Maybe it was quality parts, 10 of them. And what happens is at the end of the shift, a, a person would come along with a notebook or some, some sort of ca data capturing device and write all of this information down. They would then transfer that into some sort of Excel sheet. And at the end of the day or the end of the shift or the end of the week, typically, they would then share what the production numbers are. And this is a very manual, cumbersome process. I've actually seen some customers with whiteboards where, unfortunately, uh, by mistake, the whiteboard got written, got wiped off. Uh, kind of halfway through the shift and they had no idea what they had to produce. They had to go and manually count the parts again, etc., etc. So we've developed a solution that's much more effective. Let me show you. So the first part of the solution is actually a, within a, a mobile app. So what happens is the planner, wherever they sit in the world, can actually schedule and plan the, the targets for the day. That appears uh, on the mobile app. Um, it, this, uh, this is a sort of screen view of what you would see on, on the mobile app. And you can see the sort of targets by hour, the cumulative total. And what's really cool is I can simply enter in the targets by hour within the mobile app. And if I have a big TV on the production line, I can actually display the actual live uh, situation uh, as it happens. Um, I can also uh, enter in within the app the reasons for not making the targets so or quality breakdowns, whatever that is. Um, and if I have a touch screen, which will be even cooler, is I can actually touch on uh, each of the areas and actually type in the values within a big touch screen, uh, as you sometimes see on production lines. So once all the information has been entered, on a live basis, you can actually see uh, on a dashboard similar to this what's actually going on. So this top part is actually telling you how far you are away from your target live. And you could be anywhere in the world and you can monitor what's happening on a production line. There's no admin required to collect the data, create the charts. Um, and obviously, you can then uh, look at this over weekly, monthly, yearly uh, trends, etc. And the bottom chart is showing your quality measure. So you can actually see over here we're actually trending um, and making less and less bad parts, which is, which is a positive thing. So this is an example of how the productivity app within the Checkpoint solution helps optimize the data capturing of very simple production recording on shop floors. Here's another Machine Monday.